Not long ago, like many of you out there, I decided to get an aquarium for my home. Well, me being me, I wanted to add my own personal touch and create something just a little bit different. So, I came up with the idea of making my own blend of colored sand. Well, some interesting things happened during the process that I would like to share with you, so please allow me to demonstrate. First I found a big clear bowl and I filled it with some water so that I could see what my colored creation looked like underwater. Next, I went to the aquarium store and I got me some colored sand. Yellow, blue, and hoping they had my favorite color red, and they did, red. Now these being the primary colors and all, I thought by mixing them all together that I would get a kaleidoscope of wonderful colors and hues. Well, that was a plan anyway. So, once everything was in place, I poured all the sand into the water, starting first with the yellow sand. In it went, just like that, making the water yellow. Next, in went the blue sand. And finally, the red sand. I poured it in and well. Now when that was all finished, I reached in with my hand and mixed it up. And after it was blended thoroughly, I stepped back to admire my creation and quickly realized it was not turning out exactly as I had envisioned. As a matter of fact, it was beginning to look like one big bowl of mud. Yuck. And there was no turning back because I had already mixed all the sand together, so what was I to do? I mean, I hated throwing out all that sand and wasting all that, that money. So, the idea hit me. What a perfect opportunity to use a little magic. So, I found my magic wand and I gave the bowl a few little taps. And guess what happened? I was able to reach into that dirty water and find some of my yellow sand just like that. And then I reached back in again and yes, I was able to find some of the blue sand. And one more time, hoping they have red, hoping that I have it. And I do it again. Back into the dirty water for the red, closing my eyes. And did I do it? Is it red? It's red. So out of this dirty, muddy water, I was able to retrieve not only my yellow sand, but also my blue sand and my red sand, nice and dry, ready to use again. So the moral of the story is, if this ever happens to you, just use a little magic and you'll save a little money. Hello, I'm Charlotte Pendragon, and my Magical Mystery Sand Delusion is the clear water version of the old classic of magic, the sands of Egypt, and requires no messy or irritating chemicals to deal with. Your kit comes with everything you need to perform the Magical Mystery Sands Illusion in cabarets, clubs, theaters, television, etc., with no special requirements for lighting and or background. You get the uniquely designed Pendragon Bowl, three smaller matching bowls, over half a pound of each colored sand and approximately a quarter pound of each specially prepared reusable colored sand. I believe my personally developed blend of sand is the best on the market. The colors are steadfast and when properly cared for can be used over and over again through many performances. Also contained with your package is a detailed instructional DVD along with a complete performance routine in printed script form. The Magical Mystery Sands Illusion is available now, so what are you waiting for?